Hello everyone, and welcome back to Cliff Tips. Today, we're going to address a common issue that WordPress users encounter, strict transport security or HSTS issues. If you're seeing error messages related to HSTS, don't worry, we've got you covered. In this tutorial, we'll walk you through the steps to fix strict transport security in WordPress. So, let's dive in. First things first, let's understand what strict transport security, HSTS, is. HSTS is a web security policy mechanism that helps protect websites against various types of attacks, particularly those that involve man-in-the-middle interception of HTTPS connections. However, sometimes HSTS settings can cause issues, especially during development or migration. Step 1. Accessing the .taxes file. The first step is to access your WordPress website's .taxes file. You can do this via your hosting control panel. If you find it hard to locate your .taxes file click on the link above or in the description below. Once you're in, locate your WordPress root directory and find the .taxes file. Step 2. Adding HSTS header. Now, we're going to add the necessary code to enable strict transport security. Open the .taxes file and add the following lines. You can copy the code in the description. This code tells the browser to enforce HTTPS for your website for the next year, including all subdomains. Step 3. Testing in browser. Save the changes to your .taxes file. Now, after you save the changes on your .taxes file, we will check the HSTS preload status and eligibility. Go to https colon slash slash hstspreload.org and input your domain name and click the button. Check the two boxes and click submit. Now, it's time to test if the strict transport security header is working correctly on your website. Open up your website in a web browser and check if the HTTPS connection is enforced. You can use online tools like securityheaders.com or simply inspect the headers in your browser's developer tools. If everything is set up correctly, you should see the strict transport security header in the response headers. And there you have it. You've successfully fixed the strict transport security issue on your WordPress website. Now, your website is more secure and your visitors can browse safely. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more WordPress tips and tutorials. If you have any questions or need further assistance, feel free to leave a comment below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.